Welcome to Moxie Talk. I'm your host, Kirk Jacobs. Formerly known as Leadership Landscape TV, we've rebranded, building on the same great content. Join me as I talk with some of today's most influential leaders, one-on-one, unscripted. A lot of people ask me, why are you a young man in a hurry? I always assume I'm going to win. If you're not the lead dog, the view never changes. (laughs) Building the colonel into the world's best known person. It's difficult to be a Traeger. Discover what defines and drives these accomplished individuals. What makes them tick. Once I got elected to office and now I've served 15 months, I realized that everything I did in my life led me to this moment. More than just a teacher and and a coach. Willingness to abandon yesterday's success and go on to something something new. I love helping people solve problems. We weren't us, we weren't Creative Alliance and we just sucked royally. (laughs) Leadership is the ability to inspire greatness in others. And leadership does not discriminate. I said, look, you give me any job, but I'll be number one. You feel that uh, you're really going to be a part of the solution and not a part of the problem. I think when a person is a leader, it means that they have authority. They have authority to do good or bad. We don't have control over what people say about us exactly. or, or what they do to us or anything, but it's how we react to what mm-hmm. they do. I had the ability to change people's lives. Mm-hmm. When those women come up to me at the Center for Women and Families and they're mm-hmm. leaving out and they just want to give me a big hug and they look me in my eyes and they tell me thank you, I know I'm changing lives. Delve into the minds of these accomplished leaders to find the person behind the persona. I want them to look in the casket and say, look, he's still moving. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't change one thing in my life. Well, I've picked every Derby winner since 2007, I'm happy to say right now. But, but my last one prior to that, and I've become something of a local uh, uh, a legend, urban legend. Ridding this county of fiscal court. <laughs> <laughs> Compelling stories. The toughest part of uh, leadership for me early on, that there were people out there who didn't believe in me. Bourbon is what Kentucky is, is being recognized for now. The only individuals in the world, which is less than 1% of all practicing attorneys, that are allowed to have this type of quill pen okay. uh, are attorneys that are, have the opportunity to argue uh, before the Supreme Court of the United States. Emotional revelations. I love easily uh, all different mm-hmm. types of, of people from all walks of life. I, I, I fought the urge to, to just to die. I mean, I just wanted to literally disappear. I realized that I was trying to row across the ocean to defeat my own sense of helplessness. Surprising retrospectives in their own words. When I doubt myself, I doubt that I haven't reached far enough, Mm -hmm. big enough. If you come into this world, you got to give something Mm -hmm. back because I've had so much given to me. I would like to be remembered as as a man after God's own heart. Coach, I just got that first job. Coach. I'm going to get engaged. Coach, we're going to start a family. Nice stuff. Those things excite. Choose to be inspired. Join me on Moxie Talk.